Welcome to First and Ten, your stop for Section 2 football across the Capital Region. Now, we've been asking you all week to let your voice be heard, and guess what? Y'all spoke loud and clear, getting the most votes on our News 10 ABC webpage, Water Valite, hosting Voorheesville. It's our First and Ten game of the week where my teammate Josh Sims has been all evening and is standing by now. Josh, a lot of excitement leading up to this game. How did it play out? Well, Liana, you know, when these two teams met right over here at midfield before the game, you could sense how important a game this was for both teams. Water Valite desperately wanting a victory on their brand new football field. And for Voorheesville, they wanted to be the ones to spoil things for their division rivals. The Blackbirds strike a couple times before the Cannoneers can get on the board. It's 16 to nothing when Water Valite opens up the playbook. Michael Nadeau takes the handoff, throws to the end zone to Ryan Sandoval. Point after is no good, so it's 16 to six. Time winding down in the half. Robert Denman just heaves this up towards the end zone, and Mickey Knight is there for the catch. 23 to six at the break. Cannoneers hoping to spark something in the second half wasn't meant to be. Matt Feller takes the handoff, breaks a couple tackles, he gets to the end zone. Voorheesville with a statement win 44 to 12. The rivalry game Voorheesville versus Waterville. We've been talking about this the whole week. Uh, just it feels great. We definitely came out. We had some jitters early. You know we were happy that we played through it and, and pulled it together. You know for us I think they wanted to show that you know we're a viable contender in Class C. And it may just be week two, but after the game, you could tell how important this win was for Voorheesville when they were gathered and then walking up to the bus. They were still chanting, still very excited. And as their coach said, they certainly did make a case and a statement win in Class C. For now, live at Waterville High School, I'm Josh Sims for News 10 ABC.